The Progressive Era, Transforming American Society and Governance The Progressive Era marked a significant turning point in American history, characterized by widespread social activism and political reform. Emerging in response to the challenges of industrialization, this period sought to address the inequities and corruption that plagued society. It set the stage for transformative changes aimed at improving the quality of life for all citizens. Industrialization profoundly altered American society, bringing about rapid economic growth and technological advancements. However, it also led to harsh working conditions, exploitation, and a widening gap between the wealthy and the poor. The societal impact of industrialization served as a catalyst for the progressive movement's call for comprehensive reforms. Urbanization presented both challenges and opportunities as cities expanded rapidly. Overcrowded living conditions, inadequate infrastructure, and poor sanitation became pressing issues. At the same time, urban centers became hubs of innovation and cultural exchange, providing a fertile ground for progressive ideas to take root and flourish. Progressivism arose as a direct response to the social ills of the time, advocating for government intervention to address economic and social problems. Progressives aimed to combat corruption, improve public health, and promote education. Their efforts sought to create a more equitable society by addressing the systemic issues that disadvantaged many Americans. Key figures in the progressive movement came from diverse backgrounds, united by a common goal of societal improvement. These individuals, known as progressives, included politicians, activists, and intellectuals. Their contributions were instrumental in shaping policies and reforms that tackled issues such as labor rights, women's suffrage, and public health, leaving a lasting impact on American society. Theodore Roosevelt championed progressive reforms during his presidency, targeting powerful corporate monopolies. Known as the trust-busting president, he implemented policies to regulate large corporations and ensure fair competition. Roosevelt's efforts included enforcing the Sherman Antitrust Act, which dismantled monopolies and restored balance to the American economy. Muckrakers played a crucial role by exposing corruption and social injustices through investigative journalism. These journalists highlighted issues like political graft, poor working conditions, and corporate greed. Their revelations stirred public awareness and spurred legislative action, ultimately leading to significant reforms and greater governmental accountability. Upton Sinclair's The Jungle shed light on the appalling conditions in the meatpacking industry, sparking public outrage. The novel's vivid depiction of unsanitary practices led to the enactment of the Pure Food and Drug Act and the Meat Inspection Act, marking significant strides in food safety and consumer protection. Jane Addams pioneered the Settlement House movement, establishing Hull House in Chicago to support immigrants and the poor. Her work provided essential services like education, healthcare, and housing. Adams' efforts not only improved living conditions, but also promoted social reform and the professionalization of social work. The fight for women's suffrage culminated in the 19th Amendment, granting women the right to vote. Activists like Susan B. Anthony and Elizabeth Cady Stanton tirelessly campaigned for equal voting rights. Their perseverance led to a monumental victory, empowering women and advancing gender equality in the United States. The temperance movement sought to curb alcohol consumption, driven by concerns over social issues like domestic violence and workplace inefficiency. Advocates, including the Women's Christian Temperance Union, campaigned for prohibition. The movement culminated in the 18th Amendment, which banned alcohol, leading to a nationwide experiment with sobering consequences on society and law enforcement. Labor reforms aimed to improve working conditions, addressing the exploitation of workers in factories. Activists pushed for shorter workdays, safer environments, and fair wages. Landmark legislation, such as the Fair Labor Standards Act, emerged from these efforts, fundamentally altering the American workplace and protecting millions from hazardous conditions and unfair practices. Child labor laws were introduced to protect young workers from exploitation in mines and factories. Progressive reformers like Florence Kelly championed these laws, leading to the establishment of minimum age requirements and maximum working hours. These regulations marked a significant step towards ensuring children could pursue education and enjoy childhood. Educational reforms during the Progressive Era 
focused on expanding public schooling and improving instructional methods. Reformers like John Dewey advocated for a more practical, student-centered approach. Efforts led to the establishment of kindergartens, vocational training, and compulsory education laws, significantly increasing literacy rates and preparing a more skilled workforce for the future. The conservation movement emerged in response to the rapid depletion of natural resources. Spearheaded by figures like Theodore Roosevelt and Gifford Pinchot, conservationists worked to establish national parks, forests, and wildlife refuges. These efforts helped preserve America's natural beauty for future generations and raised awareness about the need for sustainable resource management. Progressive political reforms sought to democratize the political process and increase accountability. Primaries allowed party members to choose candidates instead of party elites. Recalls empowered citizens to remove elected officials from office before their terms ended. These reforms aimed to reduce corruption and give more power to the electorate. The Federal Reserve Act was a milestone in stabilizing the U.S. economy. It established the Federal Reserve System, providing a centralized banking authority to manage monetary policy. This act aimed to prevent financial panics and ensure economic stability by controlling inflation and regulating the money supply. Antitrust legislation was crucial in breaking up monopolies and restoring competition. The Sherman Antitrust Act and the Clayton Antitrust Act aimed to prevent business practices that stifled competition. These laws sought to protect consumers and small businesses from the predatory practices of large corporations. The Pure Food and Drug Act marked a significant step in ensuring consumer safety. It prohibited the sale of adulterated or mislabeled food and drugs. This legislation was a response to public outcry over unsafe products and aimed to protect public health by establishing standards for purity and labeling. The Meat Inspection Act reformed the meatpacking industry, mandating sanitary conditions and federal inspections. Prompted by Upton Sinclair's The Jungle, the act aimed to ensure the safety and quality of meat products. This legislation was crucial in restoring public trust and protecting consumers from contaminated food. The Progressive Era marked significant strides in African-American rights, yet it was a period of contradiction. While some progress was made, particularly through advocacy by African-American leaders, systemic racism and segregation persisted. The era's reforms often excluded African-Americans, highlighting the ongoing struggle for true equality and justice in American society. Webb Dubois emerged as a prominent figure advocating for African-American rights. Co-founding the NAACP, he championed civil rights and higher education for African-Americans. His efforts aimed to dismantle racial barriers and promote social justice, leaving a lasting legacy in the fight against racial discrimination. Religious leaders played a crucial role in the progressive movement, advocating for social justice and reform. They addressed issues like poverty, labor exploitation, and moral decay. Their moral authority and community influence mobilized support for progressive causes, intertwining religious conviction with the pursuit of societal improvement. The Settlement House movement, led by figures like Jane Addams, introduced social work as a profession. Settlement houses provided essential services to urban poor communities, including education, healthcare, and housing. This movement laid the foundation for modern social work, emphasizing community involvement and direct assistance to those in need. The Progressive Era saw a transformation in women's roles as they increasingly participated in public life and reform movements. Women advocated for suffrage, labor rights, and social reforms. Their activism challenged traditional gender roles and paved the way for greater gender equality, culminating in the eventual passage of the 19th Amendment. John Dewey's influence on progressive education emphasized experiential learning and critical thinking. He believed education should prepare individuals for active participation in a democratic society. Dewey's ideas transformed classrooms, shifting focus from rote memorization to problem-solving and collaboration, fostering a more engaged and socially aware student body. The Triangle Shirtwaist Factory Fire of 1911 exposed hazardous working conditions and inadequate safety measures in factories. The tragedy, which claimed 146 lives, spurred significant labor reforms. It led to stricter building codes, 
fire safety regulations, and the establishment of organizations advocating for workers' rights and improved workplace conditions. The 16th Amendment, ratified in 1913, introduced the federal income tax, ensuring a more equitable distribution of wealth. It provided the government with a steady revenue stream to fund public services and infrastructure. This amendment marked a significant shift towards progressive taxation, addressing economic disparities and supporting social welfare programs. The 17th Amendment, ratified in 1913, mandated the direct election of U.S. Senators by the people, rather than state legislatures. This reform aimed to reduce corruption and increase political accountability. By empowering voters, the amendment strengthened democratic principles and ensured greater representation of the electorate's interests in the federal government. The 18th Amendment, ratified in 1919, instituted prohibition by banning the manufacture, sale, and transportation of alcohol. This movement aimed to curb social problems associated with alcohol consumption. However, it led to unintended consequences such as the rise of illegal bootlegging and organized crime, ultimately resulting in its repeal by the 21st Amendment. Women's suffrage marked a pivotal moment in the Progressive Era, culminating in the 19th Amendment. This historic victory granted women the right to vote, empowering half of the population to influence democratic processes and policies. It was the result of decades of activism and advocacy by suffragists across the nation. Social Darwinism, a theory that applied Darwin's concepts of natural selection to human society, gained traction during the Progressive Era. However, many progressives rejected it, advocating for social reforms that emphasized equality and compassion over competition. This ideological shift laid the groundwork for more humane social policies. The Progressive Era saw significant growth in the middle class, fueled by economic expansion and industrialization. As incomes rose, more Americans enjoyed improved living standards, access to education, and leisure activities. This burgeoning middle class became a driving force behind many progressive reforms, seeking to improve societal conditions. Immigration surged during the Progressive Era, with millions arriving in the United States seeking better opportunities. This influx brought diverse cultures and labor, but also posed challenges such as overcrowded cities and labor exploitation. Progressives pushed for reforms to address these issues while promoting assimilation and the Americanization of immigrants. The eugenics movement, a darker aspect of progressivism, aimed to improve human genetics through selective breeding. Advocates promoted sterilization and restrictive immigration policies, targeting those deemed unfit. Although initially supported by some progressives, eugenics ultimately faced condemnation for its ethical violations and discriminatory practices. The role of technology during the progressive era was pivotal in advancing reform efforts. Innovations in communication, transportation, and industry not only fueled economic growth, but also enabled the widespread dissemination of progressive ideas. This technological boom facilitated greater public awareness and support for social, political, and economic reforms. The legacy of the progressive era is evident in many aspects of modern American life. Reforms in labor laws, women's suffrage, and consumer protections laid the groundwork for future advancements. These changes fostered a more equitable society and established a precedent for government intervention in addressing social issues. Despite its many achievements, the progressive movement faced significant criticisms. Some argued that it expanded government power excessively, while others contended that it failed to address racial and economic inequalities adequately. These critiques highlight the complexities and limitations of the era's reform efforts. Comparing progressive era reforms to modern reforms reveals both similarities and differences in approach and impact. While contemporary movements often build on past successes, they also adapt to new challenges. Understanding this historical context provides valuable insights into the evolution of American social and political change. The progressive era profoundly shaped today's America by instilling a spirit of reform and activism that continues to influence modern policies. The era's emphasis on addressing social injustices, promoting democracy, and protecting consumers set a lasting precedent for future generations committed to creating a fairer society.